Welcome back everybody. We have another room reveal for you at our Pottsboro vacation home. And today is what we call our small but mighty guest room. So come on in. This is one of the smallest rooms in the house. Um, the main purpose is a guest room. So the first thing when it comes to small guest rooms is making sure that we have the right size bed in here. So we used a queen size bed. Um, one thing to remember with guest rooms is we really want them to feel cozy and luxurious. But we want to make sure that we don't over design them. And so while this is a really small space, we wanted it to have a big impact. We did it in a way where we have the paint going three-fourths of the way up. And we actually talk about this particular treatment in another one of our videos. So we have the paint treatment going three-fourths of the way up, and then we have white the rest of the way up and on the ceiling. And what this does for a really small room is it helps give it that big impact, but also helps your eye go all the way up and makes a small room feel much larger. Um, and here we wanted it to be a little bit more playful, um, so we did these pops of deep rust velvet pillows that I love. This is one of my favorite colors right now to work with. So in here we used floor to ceiling drapes and we wanted to use a really small scale pattern. Um, on this, this is actually called a cut velvet. It's one of my favorite type of upholsteries to use. And also something for you to remember, if you ever see anything in these room reveals or any of our tips and tricks in the videos, comment below. We look at every single one of those and we'll respond. So if you see that and you're like, oh, I love that pattern, what is that called? We would love to respond to you. Um, in this room, we wanted to keep the colors fairly simple. Again, we didn't end up going with a wallpaper or anything like that. We wanted the big impact, but in really minimal ways. Something else that is really um, practical when it comes to guest rooms is making sure that when a guest is laying here in bed that they can easily turn on and off sconces. Um, we didn't have a lot of room here, so we didn't want table lamps to put here, so that's why we installed these sconces. And we didn't want really large nightstands right here, so we just put these simple drum-style tables here. One simple tip that we want to make sure that you implement in every guest room, and we put it in this one as well, is going ahead and putting all of those phone chargers. They're not the prettiest things, but every guest always asks for them, and every guest always forgets to bring them. Again, remember with small but mighty guest spaces, don't over design them, keep things neutral and simple, pick the places that you want the biggest pops. So in here, we did the paint treatment and we did the floor to ceiling drapes.